Some owners in Raleigh, in a Raleigh neighborhood, want to change the name of their street because of its ties to a former state governor. And today, City Council is taking up a proposal to decide if that will happen where the petition started. CBS 17's Randy Ayala joins us from the Five Points neighborhood where that petition got started. Randy. Yeah, Liz, this petition is calling for Raleigh City Council to change the name of Acock Street here. Uh, it's named after former state governor Charles Acock, the person behind this petition telling me it's necessary in order to bring this community together, but others feel it's just not worth the hassle. Raleigh City Council is considering a petition to rename Acock Street from Glenwood Avenue to Reeves Drive in the Five Points neighborhood. The current history we're trying mm -hmm. to create, which is changing the name and that the adults in the room realized that that was a wrong honor uh, and corrected it. Stephen Mangano has lived on Acock Street for 20 years. He started the petition after George Floyd's death and the protests that followed as a way to bring the community together. Former state governor Charles Acock supported segregating schools and played a part in the Wilmington massacre. When you go to school and you learn about the Wilmington massacre, you understand ACOC's role in sort of sparking uh, or lighting the flames. You don't want them to learn that their street was named after someone and honored after that. The Wilmington Massacre of 1898 was a mass riot and insurrection carried out by white supremacists. A post on the app next door shows the community is split. Some writing, quote, changing names does not change history, but perhaps it eases some pain. Others say spend the energy and focus fixing roads, giving scholarships, and nurturing small business. I do agree we don't need to keep promoting these uh, these racist past. At the same time, it's very much going to be a pain because we've got to change our we got to change our driver's licenses. We got to change of address. You change your address for many reasons over over the course of your life. I don't mm -hmm. think that the hassle outweighs uh, the benefit. Well, City Council is set to take up that proposal at their meeting later today. They can either approve or deny the request or delay it for further review. For now, reporting live in Raleigh, Randy Ayala, CBS 17 News. All right, Randy, thank you for that.